Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 803, which is a hard level, where we have 35 moves to clear out 22 jelly. I also see that we have three ticking time bombs set at 20, so we have a little bit less time than um, what's given here to clear these out. So we want to work on that as quickly as we can. We've got some specials that might be able to help us. They're lined up, but we've got this frosting and licorice in the way. So let's try to clear things out. I can see right away I don't have a very good setup. I'm going to leave. I'll just come back in and I don't lose a life for doing it and I don't lose any boosters if I were to bring them. Wow, this looks very much like the setup I just had, except I can make a stripe here. Hmm. And I can do this. Okay, so I like this a bit better. I've got a stripe over on this side. I've got a stripe over on this side. Now I get my reshuffle. Yeah, that's why I said a bit better. It didn't look great, but look what happened. Reshuffles are kind of awesome, and sometimes you can prompt a reshuffle. Uh, sometimes if you don't have very good moves, uh, instead of trying to set yourself up for a good move the next time around, you can set yourself up for no moves. Uh, let's see. I actually want this stripe to go along this way through this frosting, at least until it gets to this popcorn. It will stop at the popcorn. And then I can open this up. Nice. These are on the open, so I'm not particularly worried about them. Look at this. So this is set up beautifully for me. I'd like to get some green down in these areas where it can help even more. But right now, this is probably about as good as I can expect. So let's open this up as much as possible. Try to hit that popcorn. Nice. <laughs> Look at this setup now. I cannot complain. Now imagine if I had uh, left it alone, started out with that level that I had gotten before. Certainly none of this would have happened. It could have ended up with something worse, but I think I ended up with something far better. I took a risk by not playing that right away. It's always a risk if I uh, don't take what's available to me immediately. But it just looked like I could do better by waiting. All right, so this one is the last one. I've got something aimed at it. And that's how I beat this level on my first playthrough. By waiting until I had a setup that I liked, a couple of stripes I could get. And uh, that helped me to open up the board pretty quickly. Plus, of course, that reshuffle helped a lot with the ticking time bombs. That is, you know, uh, a luck thing, but it worked in my favor. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. If you have questions, put this in the comment section. And as always, thanks for watching.